Right, my next uh, question is from Sarah, who calls herself the Elmden Hippie. Thanks for your question, Sarah. And she's uh, written to me about broad beans. She's tried growing aqua dulse and imperial green long pods in chicken rich enriched soil, chicken manure enriched soil, eight to 10 plants about six inches apart in a sheltered spot. But she only gets two or three servings and the pods tend to be very spindly and underdeveloped and can turn brown. She's asked me what's happened to her crop. Well, it's important to remember actually, Sarah, that beans are very hungry and thirsty creatures. They need a lot, quite a lot of attention. And I would, what, I'd just give a, a, an advantage to them when I first plant them is before I even put them in the ground, I'd dig a trench and I'd take the soil out of that trench and in the bottom of that trench I'd laid some newspaper and I'd also put some fish blood and bone or bone meal or, or natural organic fertilizer into the bottom of that trench. I'd then take my soil from the trench and mix it with some well rotted horse manure and put that back. Now that does two, two things. One is it feeds the plants a lot, but also it helps retain moisture around the roots of the bean. They don't like dry feet. They love to have wet feet. So that gives them a really kick off start. The other thing I'd probably do is I'd give them a liquid feed over a seaweed extract, something like that. I'd apply that early in the morning when the stomata are open and the plants breathing. And that will do that every two weeks and the bean will soak that up straight into the vascular bundle and that will give them a boost as well. Remember to keep the irrigation regular as well. So with regular water, regular feeding and a really good trench full of OM and newspapers to retain the moisture, hopefully your beans will get a strong start. If they are spindly and they're going a bit brown, I would say maybe lack of moisture or also be careful how windy and how breezy the site is, they will need a little bit of shelter. I hope that answers your question, Sarah.